In Persia, people often lie down on cushions or mattresses filled with rose leaves. What a soft, sweet-scented bed. Wouldn't you like to sleep on such a bed? Yes, very good. But where shall we find rose leaves for such a bed? Hey, that's the question, isn't it? I will tell you where. You must grow the roses every day in your life gardens. How? Why thus? For every unkind word spoken to you, speak a kind one back. That kind word will be very soft, sweet-scented rose leaf to put into your rose bed at night. When your playmates are angry, you must be mild. When your brothers or, or sisters are selfish, you must be obliging and self-denying. When your mother asks you to do an unpleasant duty, obey her promptly. When your lesson is difficult, study hard. When, then when you go to bed at night, you will find your temper mild, your self-denial, your obedience, and your diligence to be both softer and sweeter than any leaves that ever grew on Persian roses. Now you see how children can sleep on roses. I hope you will go to work daily making rose leaves for your beds. And mark me, if you don't grow roses in your daily lives, you can't hinder thorns from growing. In that case, your beds will be hard things to sleep on. So I advise you to cultivate the beautiful, sweet-scented roses which adorn dutiful lives. That's good advice. May God give us kind words to speak, even when others are unkind.